Hey there everyone, this is Kevin from Ramshard, and today I will be showing you how to set up Dynamap on your Minecraft server. Doing this is fairly simple. Firstly, we want to stop your server. And after you stop your server, you want to be sure that you've created an extra port for Dynamap. And to create an extra port, click on the advanced drop down box, and then click on additional ports. And then click on the add port button that you see on the left sidebar. Alright, now that you've created an extra port, go to the files drop down tab, and then select on FTP file access. You will want to head to the plugins folder, then click into the Dynamap folder. Within the Dynamap folder, you will see a file named configuration.txt. You want to go in and click into that file and edit it. And after you are in the file editor, you want to scroll down to line 315 and replace 0.0.0.0, .0.0 with your server's numerical IP. And then you want to scroll down to line 318 and then you'll see that it says port 8123 there. You want to replace that with the extra port that you have created. After you set both options, click the save button and head back to the main page of your control panel. Now you can go ahead and start your server. Once your server is loaded up, you want to do a full render for Dynamap. To do a full render, head to the console and then type Dynamap full render and then your world name and then click enter. Now please note it will take a little bit of time for the full render to complete as it is rendering out all the chunks in the world that you have currently loaded in. Now to go to the Dynamap web page, you want to enter your numerical IP address with the extra port at the end in your search bar on your browser. And guys, that is how you set up Dynamap on your Minecraft server. If you need any further help with it, just send us a message on our live chat. And again, this has been Kevin from Ramshard.